Now, just over 11 weeks since Gabby Petito left Long Island on a cross-country trip, the FBI has confirmed that remains found in Wyoming are likely hers. This is the whereabouts of her fiancé. A person of interest in her disappearance remain unknown. CBS's John Diaz here in studio with the latest on the investigation. John? Yeah, good morning, Chris. Good morning, Mary. Well, right now, Gabby Petito's family is requesting privacy during this difficult and unimaginable time. Uh, meantime, authorities, they are waiting to get official confirmation on the body that was found. This morning, anguish and heartbreak, no doubt, starting to set in for the Petito family. Authorities revealed Sunday afternoon that they believe they found the remains of the Blue Point Long Island native in the Grand Teton National Park in Wyoming. The cause of death has not been determined. Just days ago, her father remained hopeful his daughter would be found alive. Positivity is hard. I'm trying to focus on on the scenario I have in my head that she's stuck somewhere and she's just, you know, uh, just needs help, you know, and we, you know, we got to just go get her and, and bring her home. Yesterday, the grief stricken father of the 22 year old posted a message on social media saying in this post that she touched the world. As every parent can imagine, this is an incredibly difficult time for the family. Petito was traveling in a van out west with her fiance Brian Laundry when she disappeared. Her family says they last heard from her in late August. Laundry returned home to Florida without her on September 1st. That is five days after a Florida couple says they spotted what they believed was Petito's van at the Spread Creek dispersed camping area. We came across a white van that had Florida plates, a small white van. We were going to stop and say hi because we're from Florida too, but the van was completely dark. There was nobody there, so we decided to continue on our way. While officials wait on official confirmation of the body discovered believed to be Petito, investigators spent a second day searching a nature reserve for laundry. Full forensic identification has not been completed to confirm 100% that we found Gabby, but her family has been notified of this discovery. A case that appears to have nearly brought the supervising FBI agent to tears as he expressed condolences to the young woman's loved ones. We appreciate your cooperation and respect for Gabby's family. Thank you. Again, the whereabouts of Brian Laundrie are still unknown. His family's attorney, though, released a statement last night saying, quote, the news about Gabby Petito is heartbreaking. The Laundrie family prays for Gabby and her family. Mary, will send it right back to you. John Diaz, John, thank you so much.